regarding uh, the bus transportation. I'm going to take you through some examples with uh, some little video clips of how that's going to work and, uh, and the safety precautions that, we, that we've built in. Um, so uh, you will first notice that uh, we have very, very friendly staff on the buses. Um, there will be seating charts for students to try to space them out as, as uh, much as possible uh, to increase that social distancing availability. If we have siblings on the bus and, um, and if spaces are becoming uh, a little more at a premium, uh, siblings are allowed to sit together. Um, all students will be wearing masks. Then uh, during, uh, this is also to increase the, uh, the airflow circulation inside the buses, the windows will be opened uh, three clicks. And so for that reason, we have uh, communicated to families, we recommend uh, that you also reinforce this, that the students may be dressed a little extra warmly and uh, just uh, because of that, but there is a, a safety benefit in this as well. And, and that, so the, uh, at the end of every route, the bus drivers will wipe down every uh, high touch area. Um, so the railings, the, uh, the edges of the seats uh, and so forth. And again, this is done at the end of every route. Uh, at the end of the day, every bus will be electrostatically cleaned. So these are cleaners that uh, provide a, a charge to the, uh, to the disinfectant particles that sort of like a static electricity, and they will be attracted to the surfaces so that uh, the disinfectant isn't um, circulating around through the air. It's actually just um, being attracted to the areas that you want them to uh, do their work on.